Tango Sierra Foxtrot Charlie, uh, currently over Whitstable. We're diverting out over to the wind farm and returning uh, back to Whitstable uh, and heading and routing back to Stapleford. Welcome to the autopilot episode. Before engaging the autopilot, we comply with ATC instructions to turn right onto 190. Just like a cruise control in a car, the autopilot is best engaged when we fly in a straight line. When we turn on the autopilot, it will fly the selected heading and keep the current pitch. On the PFD, we can see that we have heading mode and pitch active by the green colored text. The altitude indicator is set to 7000, which means that we will level off at 7000. We will, however, not reach Miami by flying in a straight line. So, we use the CDI button to select GPS as navigation source. We then switch the autopilot to navigation mode. As you can see, we are now turning right. What happened is that the system known as the flight director has determined that in order to follow our flight plan, we need to turn right. The flight director is the brain that tells the autopilot what actions to carry out. You can see the flight director commands as magenta colored lines outside the yellow arrow on the PFD. If you wish, you can even turn off the autopilot and hand fly the plane after the flight director's instructions. As we reach our planned course, the autopilot turns left to let us intercept our intended flight plan. We can now also note that we reached our target altitude of 7000 feet and the autopilot has switched from pitch hold mode to altitude hold mode. You see this indicated by the green letters ALT on the top of the PFD as well as by the light next to the altitude hold button on the autopilot console. We are now coming up to a turning point and we will again see how the flight director is flying for us. We use the range knob to zoom in to make it more visible. You can see how our current leg turned white, the second leg is activated. We are just north of the Cypress VOR, and the flight director has already initiated a left turn to make the flight as smooth as possible. We are now well on our way to Miami, which brings this episode to an end.